What up, everybody? It's Wild Card Weekend. Uh, Eagles are playing the Packers down at Lincoln Financial Field today. Um, going back to Saturday, uh, Saints knocked off by the uh, Seahawks. No one saw that coming. And then the Jets knock off the uh, Colts last night. I didn't see that coming. But um, today we have the second scoring defense in the Packers going up against the second scoring, scoring offense in the Eagles. Um, I want to rewind a little bit to the Vikings game. Um, they just look like shit, the Eagles. Um, Mike Vick was overthrowing receivers. He was throwing balls into defensive backs' hands. I'm surprised there wasn't more interceptions. And um, he was carrying the ball around like a loaf of bread and get, got his pocket picked um, one time. He, uh, Vikings were coming with that cornerback blitz, blitz by Antoine Winfield all game, and nobody adjusted to it. Um, and then we couldn't get any turn turnovers off of Joe Webb. Um, and Andy and Marty got off their game plan. Red zone D still was terrible. Um, so, this song I'm playing is Tighten Up by the Black Keys. It should be an anthem for the Eagles today. Um, the D needs to tighten up, O-line needs to tighten up, and Mike Vick needs to tighten his ass up. Um, Vick needs to stay clean, um, can't be turning the ball over, and then also Deshaun needs to run some better routes this game, because he was playing lazy last uh, game against the Vikings. Um, I look for the Eagles to try to start off quick. They need to start off quick. Uh, they need to put some points up early um, against the Packers. And if not, do I trust Andy Reid to keep the play calling balanced? Um, for the love of God, Andy, just keep that balanced play calling going. It'll make it much easier for the rest of the team. Um, they need to feed Shady McCoy early and often. Um, I want to, I want to him to have at least 20 touches, you know, 20 to 25 touches in this game, maybe 30. Um, just feed him. Uh, he is a dynamic player, and I think he doesn't get enough credit. Um, Vicky needs to do a better job at recognizing blitz. Everybody needs to do a better job at recognizing the blitz. The receivers need to break off um, their routes when they know something's coming like that. Vic needs to know where Clay Matthews and Charles Woodson are on the field at all times. Uh, 52 and 21. Just recognize where they are. Uh, so I look for a lot of max protect in this game. Brent Selk, uh, I don't expect him to have a lot of catches. Um, but the Eagles will continue to look for the big play. Um, Vic had his opportunities against the Vikings and just couldn't connect. Um, first play of the game, I look for um, a play action dump off screen to Shady McCoy or Brent Selk. Um, Everybody expects a big play the first game, but I think they're going to switch it up and try to mess with the Packers' head. Um, on defense, Sean McDermott needs to call a game of his life. Um, this D has shown the ability to shut down quarterbacks. Matt Ryan, Peyton Manning, Aaron Rodgers didn't have that great of a game the first time out here. Um, so I look for um, Aaron Rodgers to try to attack Asante early, see if that knee is holding up. Uh, if so, then Dimitri Patterson is going to have a target on him all game. Uh, Sean McDermott needs to, you know, realize Dimitri Patterson's weaknesses and just find a way to cover it up all game. Uh, he's an aggressive corner, um, so you might see a couple double moves. Um, those double moves won't happen if the front four can get pressure. Uh, this front four has not been playing spectacular football all year. So, I mean, you can't just blitz Aaron Rodgers out the ass. He's awesome against the blitz. He's got like a 109 quarterback rating against that. Um, I look for Aaron Rodgers to spread the Eagles out a lot using three, four, five, or five receiver sets. He's going to go after Jose Lee Hanson and Trevard Lindley as well. Um, so the blitzes need to be timed right and need to be effective. I'm not really too worried about the Packers ground game. They do have a uh, Shippensburg alum, Mr. Uh, John Kuhn. So um, <laughs> he's been big in short yardage and goal line situations. Um, I think Jamar Cheney will be starting today. He's a rookie. I don't think Stuart Bradley's going to be back. He's decent against the run. Um, shown some ability in the passing game, but Eagles have always been burnt by tight ends. Um, so I look for them, the Packers, to try to exploit our linebackers as well. Um, key matchups today are going to be Vic versus the Packers D. Uh, Aaron Rodgers versus Sean McDermott. They're going to be playing chess all game. And... Uh, Dimitri Patterson will probably be lined up against Greg Jennings all game, or for most of it. Um, Eagles are coming in as three-point favorites, but um, it really feels like the underdogs because nobody's really picking them. I know the money is even on each side, but um, in the end, I think this game's going to come down to Andy Reid. Um, 
I have full faith in Andy Reid that he will ha has taken this time since the Vikings game to really game plan for the Packers. Uh, it should be an interesting game. Hope it's good. Um, and my final score, I'm going to say, is going to be 27, 26. The Eagles in a tight one. Um, have a good day. Have a good day, everybody. <laughs>